Hey YouTube fam, it's your girl Leah back again with another video. In today's video, as you can see from the title, we're just going to be going through my spring capsule wardrobe. Now, I did this video for the winter and I said I was going to do a spring version because what I love and the pieces that I love in the fall, winter, spring, they can all merge together, but then there are some pieces that I think are definitely season essential. So I'm going to be talking about the essentials that I love for the spring. And you guys let me know down below some essentials that you guys love. Now, in my winter version of this, I'm a boots girl. You guys know I'm my little booties down. If you follow me on my Instagram, the days that I go places, I do an outfit of the day in my stories, and you guys probably notice a theme in the winter where it's boots. I'm boots down. I showed in my winter, it's either the Ralph Lauren, the camel colored or blacks. Now, we still love the camel color, we still love the blacks, but this season is about the flats, okay? It's flat season for me, and I love a good flat. Like, I love a good boot, but it's flat season for me. Now, I'm not a very big heel girl. I don't know if I ever had a real heel phase because I'm not that coordinated with the walking in the heels. Now, I have loved a heel, and I'll talk about that in a moment, but I have loved a flat too. My favorite flats are the Tory Burches. You guys see me wear the Miller flats all the time. I also like the loafers as well. I have those in a black and a brown color as well you find some variety in your style but i do find that it works and again i'm about not over consuming so i can go to target get the flats i used to love the target flats but what i found is for them being 19.99 i was having to repurchase them over and over again because the lasting power was not the same as my toy birch flats which i wear constantly constantly i also have been loving a little heat and we might can call it a kitten heel. I might be in my kitten heel era, and I'm okay with that. But the heels I've been loving, again, heels that I've bought in two different colors, a black and a kind of nudish brown camo color, are the Bianca Slingbacks from Sam Edelman. Such great heels. Comfortable for me, a girl who doesn't love heels, but when I want to get above a, get a flat, and the fact that their swingbacks, again, work well for the spring, might not work as well for the winter because, again, my feet be getting cold, but now that we're in the spring, I can finally get them swingbacks in. These are very popular shoes on the Sam Edelman site, very popular just in general, and they do have several different colors, so you're not just limited to the blacks and the camels like basic old me, but again, this is my capsule wardrobe, and capsule for me means I can mix and match and not be limited to, oh, I picked the yellow shoe or I picked a red shoe or I picked a shoe that doesn't match a majority of my outfits. I want to mix and match and that's what a capsule wardrobe is for me. And what matches and mixes really well are a white belt down. I love a good white button down. Please white button down me over here. It's so timeless. It's so chic. It goes with multiple things. I like to layer it with a blazer. I like to wear it on its own. It's white button down season for me and I love it. But in the spring, I like to also throw in some colorful button downs as well. I've really been liking the silky button downs from Zara. I have that in multiple colors. I love the light flowiness of it. Again, works perfectly fine for a good spring when we don't want a lot of layers. We don't want a lot because we are getting a little bit warmer the other day. Again, mid-March, we were hitting at 80 degrees. So again, we don't want super warm, but the morning was 40. So the morning was 40. By 5, we were at 80. We got 40 degrees in between there. There's going to be times where it's chillier, and that's where that flowy blouse of it all comes into play. So I love a good colorful blouse on top of the basic white button down. Another love, it's time for the basic tees to come out. White, black, whatever. I love the unique glow basic tees. They're basics everything. They're a very basic site, but they're basic white and black tees. Pairing them with a jean, we're in the season for the basic white top. Classic staple for the spring. Sneakers, we are in our sneaker season as well. For me, I love the Adidas sneakers. Like, I don't know. They're so comfortable. They're so lightweight. They're so easy to walk in for me. I really am thinking about getting the Sambas, which are also uh, Adidas brand. People like those for a little bit more structure. They can wear them with not just jeans, but other attire. You guys, if you have Sambas out there, tell me because I think I want a pair. 
of those this spring. They're very affordable. I'm not a sneakerhead girl. Like I'm not a girl who knows a lot about sneakers, who wears them a lot. I did not get that jean, but I like a good pair because I do a lot more walking. It's a lot more walking winny. Not to say I don't walk during the winter, but the walks are a lot more abbreviated and um yeah, they're no longer than 10 minutes. I ain't about to be outside for too long. But now we can go on our longer 10 to 15 minute, 20 minute walks. I need something comfortable. And I love these sneakers. These are the only sneakers I actually own. Spring is also the time for me where I wear more light wash jeans. Now I wear jeans in the winter, but they're more the dark wash. I feel comfortable in the dark wash. We get into the season where light wash starts to be a thing. And I love a good pair of light wash jeans some brands that make some good light wash jeans amber crombie make good jeans good american makes some really good jeans i don't think i have any from made well but i hear made well makes some incredible jeans as well the light wash jean season is one of my favorite jean seasons it also makes my butt look bigger as somebody who has zero percent butt light wash jeans are my favorite season because dark wash don't do anything they compress it so that's why me having no butt Loves a good white wash jeans. It just does something for me, me personally. It's also cardigan season. We're kind of out of very big coat season here. But as I mentioned, it can be 40 degrees in the morning and it can be 80 degrees in the afternoon. So cardigans are the way I can get away with not going home. Like the other day, I did wear a super big coat because um, it was like 40. I had to wipe the ice off my car. So I wore a big coat. I was looking crazy by the end of the day. Now we're starting to teeter-totter into some cardigan seasons. I love a good cardigan. My favorites are from Old Navy has some good cardigans. Gap has some good cardigans. We're also in the season where I love a good cream or light colored purse. You know, winter for me. I love my blacks. I love my camel color. That's what I had in my list. I love my Marc Jacobs tote bag, which is a good spring purse as well, but I can get a little bit more fair in my purse colors. And that includes the light and the creamy colored purse, the top colored purses in this season and last but not least a good upper long sleeve kind of shorter dress and what i mean is the sleeves can be on the dress but the, the dress doesn't go a long length if that makes sense so those are my favorite for the spring time months especially a good collared cute outfit chef's kiss so those are i think my 10 essentials for my spring capsule wardrobe if i missed anything let me know down below i again think my pieces carry over and hold over well in this season but again i'll do this same video in summer so make sure that you're locked in because i have some pieces that i didn't mention you guys think summer and spring kind of run together i have some things that i really lean towards in the summer so make sure you're locked in subscribed and have that notification bell so you don't miss that video or any other video that i create on this platform, make sure you're following me on Instagram at Leelavon89 to keep up with my shenanigans in real time. TikTok at Leelavon, which is a bit more shenanigans and a little bit more real time. And I post probably triple what I post on TikTok than I do on Instagram. So make sure you're locked in there. And I'll see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. You for real.